Two big software updates are coming and exciting news about the new Model 3 Ludicrous plus a brand new Tesla incentive. Let's get into all of that and more in today's video. The Model 3 Ludicrous, said to be Tesla's Model 3 performance refresh, is coming soon. Sightings have been more and more frequent here in the States, now seeing this new Model 3 Ludicrous with a camo wrap showing new features. Like we covered in other videos, these newest sightings show us even clearer features of this new Model 3 Ludicrous with new rims seen with what appears to be the inserts removed, showing the 20 inch warped wheels on this new Model 3. A new front splitter is a unique design only to this new Model 3, and now we see even clearer images of the rear changes of this Model 3 with the air diffuser and new rear design. If you missed it recently, a new carbon fiber dash was also spotted just recently through the windshield of what appears to be the new Model 3 Ludicrous, but here is also the latest. For the first time, we see what could be this new Model 3 3 at the Austin headquarters, what appears to be the new Model 3 Ludicrous, shown in an overhead drone footage view, could be the latest signs that this Model 3 is coming soon, with the ETA slated to be estimated in May. Perfect timing on a years-long feature request involving the safety of your Tesla. Finally, this week, the NHTSA, the National Traffic Safety Association, finally approved the Matrix Adaptive Headlights here in the States. If you're unaware, Teslas in Europe just received this adaptive functionality with an over-the-air update, and because of years-long regulation, which was approved years ago here in the States, but finally signed off on this week, the adaptive headlights have not made it yet. If you're unaware, Teslas in other countries already have matrix or otherwise called LED adaptive headlights. After years of regulation here in the States that again began years ago, it was finally officially approved. So we could be seeing a new Model 3 with these new matrix headlights or current Teslas receive this functionality through a free over the air update. Did you know that these adaptive headlights have individual LED lights that turn off so that oncoming traffic or pedestrians are not blinded by the LED lights? However, it still allows you to see the remainder of your surroundings and road at a far distance. So the LED lights effectively light up what you need to see and avoid what you don't. That's one big software update. Another allows your Tesla to park itself with one touch of a button, but there's a big limitation. We're going to talk about that in a minute. New incentives if you take delivery this month. And this is big if you are thinking about a Model Y, S, or X. At this time, referrals don't work on the Model 3. Again, Y, S, or X, and here it is. By the way, the best Tesla accessories are linked down below. Things like console organizers, screen protectors, floor mats, sorted by popularity. So it does support the channel, which I would greatly, greatly appreciate. So check them out if you're buying a Tesla down in the description below. Now you're going to get one year of free premium connectivity. Premium connectivity is a subscription plan that you pay for that I subscribe to so I can talk to this. One of the biggest benefits that you will see from premium connectivity is the live streaming of Sentry Mode to your mobile phone. It gives you enhanced traffic visualizations as well. But again, this premium connectivity will now come free if you take delivery in the month of March. Plus, you're going to get the current three months of free full self-driving as well. Another incentive rolled out. This one is a little limited, but if you do have a reservation for a Cybertruck, now if you take delivery in March, you're gonna save an extra $1,000 if you place an order for a Tesla and take delivery in this month of March. But don't forget an incentive that applies to everybody. 10,000 supercharger miles are available this month. If you trade in a vehicle and purchase a Tesla this month, current Tesla owners can pick a free color upgrade as well. Another incentive happening right now. And wait, if you're a Model Y buyer, those prices are going to go up 
$1,000 April 1st. So there's a lot of moving parts and incentives to think about. The second big software update that is going to come to you free of charge and will allow your Tesla to park itself in addition to other benefits. But like we said, there's some limitations. Let's get into it. A tap to park function is now currently being rolled out to Teslas. So now you can exit your vehicle and press a button and your Tesla will identify a parking spot and park itself. But the limitation, Tesla has been doing a lot with parking technology. Do you remember the last holiday update saw a 3D high fidelity parking assist rolled out to Teslas that do not have the USS sensors. So this allowed Teslas that solely used Tesla vision or only the cameras around your car to have a 3D rendering of the space around it when moving into a parked position. Another limitation is it does seem that this function is only being rolled out to Tesla employees at this time to perhaps test the functionality. That is very likely to change but this is per not a Tesla app. So we should see this functionality rolled out to all Teslas without the USS functionality very soon. If you're buying a Model 3 or a Model Y, I want you to listen to this. This is important. Model 3 buyers, currently the only Model 3 that qualifies for the EV tax credit is the Model 3 performance. Now it has been confirmed that current Model 3 performance vehicles from 2023 per the IRS website do qualify if you find one on Tesla's inventory page. The new Model 3 performance, the ludicrous model, is said to qualify as well as the IRS website says 2024 models. So if you are a Model 3 buyer, now's a great time to purchase if you're comfortable with the prices of the rear wheel drive and the long range, or if you're looking for that Model 3 performance, currently not available on the website. Once that goes online, it does seem that that vehicle will have extra incentives. And Model 3 buyers, that vehicle is not listed under the referral program, unfortunately. I will let you know when that changes, so make sure to stick around, and that way you can get extra incentives. As we said, there's a $1,000 discount added if you take delivery of qualifying vehicles in the month of March and you get three months full self-driving. Again, for the Y, S, or X. Model Y buyers, some advice. It is already confirmed that there will be no refresh of the Model Y codenamed Juniper online this year. Again, no Model Y refresh for 2024 already confirmed. What I will tell you is all Model Ys qualify for the EV tax credit. The Model Y is expected to go up in price on April 1st, so at least at this time of making the video, you have a few weeks until that $1,000 price increase. If you're watching this video and it's past that time or you're not ready to buy, all Model Ys are going to continue to qualify for the IRS tax credit in 2024. A new incentive was just added for used Teslas. So if you're purchasing a used Tesla, listen up, a $4,000 credit was now added that you get at the time of delivery for used Teslas, but the rules are as follows. The car must be two years older or more past the current calendar year. So if it's 2024, it has to be from 2022 or older. The vehicle must be $25,000 or less. And there's also some income requirements as well. Again, very few Teslas are going to qualify for this, but over time, you may see some pop up again in Tesla's used inventory page. So keep an eye out for that. Never a bad thing if you're looking for a used Tesla. A lot of people just want to get into a Tesla and I would highly recommend it, especially with this new $4,000 credit. A lot of you have already subscribed. If you learned something in this video, I would appreciate you subscribing and tapping that notification button. As always, you can drop a like so I know that you're out there watching. Again, this is Matt from Frunk to Trunk. We will see you in the next video.